Yeah, this is something I've been pondering on the past couple of days. Saul of Tarsus. He was roughly about the same age as Jesus. It'd have to be two years older or two years younger. Think about it. Herod killed all the youngins up to two years old. Wasn't it up to two years, around two years old uh, back when Jesus was born? All right, so it'd have to be older or younger, or they know darn tootin' he's not the Messiah. We sure find out that later anyway. Saul of Tarsus is a second generation Pharisee, so he had a daddy as a Pharisee. Saul's daddy sent him to the Galamiel, Gal whatever his name is. Gamaliel, the greatest Pharisee teacher in Pharisee teacher school. Um, he also, if I'm not mistaken, told the Pharisees and Acts they best leave uh, Peter and John alone because they might be setting themselves up against God. So Saul's own teacher told him he best watch it. Anyway, Saul's a proud, arrogant, boastful. Uh, not going to give us char in charge up for nobody. All right. And uh, let's, let's get back to the kid day of Saul. Now remember, he's a second generation Pharisee. His daddy was a Pharisee at the time Saul was a kid. That's how it works. All right. Saul and Jesus was the, roughly the same age up to, you know, four years of difference. Above and below. Saul's daddy was a Pharisee. Jesus running around in Jerusalem running around town there, 12 years old, blowing the Pharisees' minds. Blowing their minds, this kid knew so much. So, uh, Saul's daddy had a son. Saul's daddy sent his son to Pharisee school to learn by the greatest Pharisee. Saul's daddy probably went home at night and says, son, you gotta be like this fella I seen. He, he knows it. So Saul knew, knew of Jesus as a kid. So don't tell me Saul never knew Jesus. Saul's daddy probably took his son to see the kid. Did Saul have daddy issues? Because his daddy spoke so highly? Of this little boy about Saul's age. Ponder on it. God bless.